What's going on Skid? Today we got a microwave that is sparking and smelling like smoke. So let's see what's up. Ooh! Somebody out here making some memories with the microwave. Now this is a real common problem with these GEs. I've done about, geez, dozens of them out here. Very simple fix. This right here is called the uh, stir blade cover or fan stir, stir blade cover, something like that. But yeah, if you're looking for it, stir blade cover. Very common with these GE microwaves. This is a really simple fix. All you're gonna need is a little tiny flathead. Pop this little tab down. Pull that little tab out and then pull this over to the right. And then it should come on out. And I'll show you. Oh. I'll show you why why it's doing what it's doing all the grease so you can see all the grease that gets around the edges here this one's actually not that bad it's not good but it's not that bad I've seen worse where it's just built up around the edge so it gets grease around the edge and then it starts a grease fire it gets all hot and starts boiling the, the oil and the grease that's on these things and it starts smoking causes a fire and this is the stirrer blade. And this is usually pretty good. You can reuse this, but you got, you're going to have to get a new cover. That's what I do. I just throw in a new cover and let it roll. I never hear from them again. Probably until more grease builds up in the new one. But you know what am I supposed to do about that? It's like a design flaw. It sits up here at the top. You put your bowl of chili in here. I mean, what do you expect? You're going to get oil and grease and all that crap around the top and it's going to get into the crease and build and build and build and build and it starts a grease grease fire. That's what happened here. Man, I've seen them all charred up. I'm talking about, I don't know how it didn't set the place on fire. This is a minor case here. I've seen way worse. But, man, come on, GE. I kind of pioneer of the industry, someone who pretty much started all this make crap like this. You sit around in the boardroom with your yellow notepads and this is what you come up with. We'll put this up here so when I put my when I put my hormel chili in, grease builds up and starts a fire. And before you pop your new cover in, make sure you get all the grease and oil that's around here where the old one was. Because if it's greasy, it's just gonna get in the new one. And I know people are supposed to cover their food with a napkin, but not kids, you know, you, a 12 year old kid ain't gonna throw some Denny Moore in here and cover it with a napkin or ravioli or whatever. It's gonna put it in there and butt naked. It's just gonna be, you know, popping and <laughs> just throwing food and grease all over this thing. So just clean it before you pop the new one in. All right, got my new one. Again, this is a stir blade cover and you can use the old blade that came out of the, the old one. Never had any issues, they're always good. Now these little tabs, get a bag of these if you guys have these on your property or something similar because these things break easy. Sometimes they'll melt along with the cover. So get you some of these little tabs that pop up in there. This is the, uh, the part number if you're looking for it. What a design flaw, man. I mean the refrigerators too. Those, I don't know if you guys have seen my videos with the refrigerators. Those things are dud with the circuit boards. The circuit boards are always freezing up. Old GE, man, I tell you. I don't know if they're putting stuff out like, like guitars, you know. Gibson's got the Epiphone, which is cheaper. And Fender's got the, the Squire, which is a cheaper version. That's all there is to it, man. Just pop that in there and put your tab in there. Boop, and that's all there is to it. Get you a coffee mug of water, put it in there, test it out if you want. I won't put it on for too long because I don't have a, a mug, but. No more sparking, no more fire. Again, real easy fix. All right, see y'all in the next video. Later.